it's like with oil paint or painting or something, you know, a friend of mine said, paint a hundred and see if you're good at it. You know, after a hundred, maybe you'll know. Honesty and the urge to, to stage dive. Not an urge to, to flamboyantly throw themselves off on a stage and a self-righteous exposing of their own selves. Uh, I think spiritually they should feel that they have to fling themselves off the stage. <laughs> Thank you so much. Well, I mean, I think looking back, the fact that we were able to take breaks and there were a handful of times during the that Vitalogy era when things got tense, we just said, let's just take a break and maybe cancel this tour and maybe cancel these shows and, you know, let everybody kind of just retreat and, you know, collect their thoughts and... I think those handful of moments where we did those things, and I, I don't know if it was wisdom or just survival or whatever, but I think those things kind of really saved it because, you know, there's no, there's no, you know, classroom that tells you what pace, you, you know, is the healthy pace. You know, you, basically people are just saying, throwing this stuff at you and it all seems cool and on paper it's like, well, hell yeah, I want to play with Keith Richards and I want to go make a record with Neil Young and I want to do this and I want to... But after, you know, a few years of just kind of being around each other all the time, talking about ourselves all the time, and, you know, it was huge at that point, I think, you know, I think it just, it's just too much energy, you know, it, it implodes, and somehow we eluded that for the most part, so, but, you know, I think a little bit of luck and a little bit of just kind of sensing that... <laughs> It might not last if we don't kind of just take a break right now. Longboat captain, take the reins. Steer us towards the clear. I know it's already been a song. Can't be said enough. Love is all you need. All you need is love. 